Hey guys, welcome to Grand Pound Gaming. This is going to be the first 30 minutes of Red Dead Redemption 2. Abigail says he's dying, Dutch. We'll have to stop someplace. Okay. Arthur's out looking. I sent him up ahead. Uh. If we don't stop soon, we'll all be dying. This weather, it's May. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There. Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he, you know, an old man in town, abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! Not a situation you want to be in. Bring him in here! <clears throat> Miss Gaskell, get that fire lit quick. Miss Jones, bring in whatever blankets we have. Mr. Pearson, see what we've got in terms of food. Davy's dead. There was nothing more you could have done. What are we gonna do? We need supplies. Well, first of all, you're gonna stay here, and you were gonna get yourself warm. Now, I sent John and Mike scouting out ahead. Arthur and I, we're gonna ride out, see if we can find one of them. And this? Just for a short bit. And I don't see what other choice we have. Listen. Listen to me, all of you, for a moment. Now, we've had, well, a bad couple of days. I loved Davy, Jenny, Sean, Mac. They may be okay. We don't know. But we lost some folks. Now, if I could throw myself in the ground, in their stead, I'd do it, gladly. But we are going to ride out, and we are going to find some food. Everybody, we're safe now. There ain't nobody 
following us through a storm like this one. And by the time they get here, well, we're gonna be, we're gonna be long gone. We've been through worse than this before. Mr. Pierce, Miss Grimshaw, I need you to turn this place into a camp. We may be here for a few days. Now, all of you, all of you, get yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet, so they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey. I ain't had time to ask. Me. What really went down back there on that boat? We missed you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey. You need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith. Get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. I. We need you strong. Here we go. All right, let's head out. I ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close. We'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather. Been two days or more like this now. Oh, it has to blow over soon. people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. Uh, a couple more days, we'll be on the other side. You need to help me pick the others back up. You're the only one I can rely on to stay strong right now. Hey, I think I see something up the path. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Anyone home? Sure. Place is blazing with light and noise. Sounded like a party. Let's go see. Follow me. <clears throat> How's Davy doing? Well, he didn't make it. Nor did little Jenny. That's too bad. Davey was a real fighter. Both of them calendar boys is. Er, <laughs> was. Yeah. And Mac, Sean, we don't know. Quite a business. I'm glad you're all right, Micah. Always. Ask him if he's seen John. Hey, have you seen John, Micah? Seen him. He'll be fine. Thinks so? up. Mac and Sean are still out there somewhere, too. Hey, Arthur, let me take the rear. You move up. Passing you. Go on. You run into anybody else? I, I reckon. We're the only ones crazy enough to be out in this, Morgan. Yeah, well, don't talk to me about crazy. Oh, so no, glad you're all right. I was worried, Micah. Look, it's all gonna work out, Morgan. We lost a few folks, but that's just how it goes sometimes. Well, I'm glad you're feeling so good about it. Where are all the others? Old mining camp, back up the hill. It ain't much, but it's shelter. So, this house, you speak to the people there already? No. Like Dutch told us, look, but don't talk to no one. 
Just following orders. You know me. Right. How much further? Not far. What does that mean? Not far. Uh, thanks. Oh, goddamn, this snow gets right to the bone. Oh, it's not much further. Okay, let's keep it down now, gentlemen. It's just up ahead. Snuff and those lanterns, boys. Best you two lie low on this. Okay, let's head down there. So easy to get lost in the atmosphere of this game. It's gorgeous. Let's hitch up here. Let me do the talking. We don't want to scare these folks. Sounds like quite the party. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. Micah, get down behind that wagon in front. See how this goes. Hello? Shut up, Billy. Shh. Excuse me. Hello? Oh, well, hello, friend. What you want? I am very sorry to disturb you. Uh, my friends and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, uh, gentlemen. <laughs> we can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the trail. Arthur, we got a problem. Oh, <laughs> oh look, there's a corpse right now. I, I just Arthur, need some there's a body in the wagon. Uh, and just gentlemen. keep your... I think you should go now, buddy. <laughs> Shit! Look out! There's more... <laughs> Right beside me. One of them's making a run for it. Done and done. Closer to the house. Arthur, let's go search the cabin. Smells like a party in here. We need the essentials. Food, medicine, whiskey. Oh, I'm starving. You should eat something now. 
Get your strength up for the ride back. Driscoll's. I don't believe it. It's a strange one, all right. Maybe they're hiding up here, too. There's a big price on Colm O'Driscoll's head. Nearly as big as the one on yours. One Colm dead is about the only thing me and Uncle Sam agree on. Place is dry and warm. We could maybe move the women and Jack down here. Maybe. We'll see how they are when we get back. I don't really want us to split up. Keep searching while I pack these on the horses. Will do. Grab anything you think we can use, then meet me out here. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Already on it. You search the cabin, see what we missed. Oh, there's a barrel in my way. to rob some train gonna blow the tracks <laughs> well I would say it looks like you have this Arthur do what you want with him I don't care but <laughs> get the hell out of here go anyway that looks like a decent horse you should keep them tie them up over there Arthur Leave her alone! 
wasn't doing nothing. She's one of them O'Driscolls. No, she ain't, Michael. Look at her. Miss, miss. Are you... Oh, you fool. Michael. Miss, now, it is going to be okay. We mean you no harm. Miss, miss. Come on. It'll be okay. We need to get out of here and quick. Come on now. Oh. Are you okay, miss? They came three days ago. Then Bob has been me. Miss, you are safe now. And you can't stay here. You come with us. Of course. Miss, it's okay. We're bad men. He ain't them. It's okay. Get on. We'll keep you safe until you figure out what you want to do. What's your name, miss? Miss. Adler. Adler. Sadie Adler. Mrs. I... He... He was my husband. That is dramatic. Hey! Somebody's coming! Looks like it's Dutch. Hey, everybody, Dutch is back! How'd you get on? Uh, Micah found a homestead, but he weren't the first. Home O'Driscoll and his scum, they beat us to it. Uh, we found some of them there, but there is more about, apparently. Scouting the train. Thank you. That's the last thing we need right now, Dutch. Well, it is what it is. But we found some supplies, some blankets, a little bit of food, and this poor soul, Mrs. Adler, Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something? And Mrs. Adler, it's going to be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Mr. Morgan, we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? How come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. We'll just go ahead and rewrite that. I can load up my last game from the manual save. I'm surprised that was the first auto save. Five minutes in. He ain't been seen in days. Weather ain't let up. He's strong. And he's smart. Strong, at least. Hello, Arthur. Abigail. Arthur, how you doing? Just fine, Abigail. And you? I need you to... I'm sorry, I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know. The situation were reversed. And he looked for me. Thank you. This way. Last I know, John was headed up the river. For all we know, he kept riding north and never looked back. He wouldn't leave. Not like that. 
Uh, wouldn't be the first time. Take a look. Let's hope it ain't more of O'Driscoll's boys. Well, seems somebody left recently. And that way. Sure, well, come on then. There's some tracks leading to the river. Eso. Yeah. I can't see any tracks. Let's cross. See, they continue up that way. The snow is too bright. You think it's John? You tell me. These are horse tracks for sure, but it could be anyone. Let's just see where they lead. So, you were there, Javier. What really happened on that boat? We had the money, it seemed fine. Then suddenly they were everywhere. Bounty hunters? No, Pinkertons. It was crazy. Raining bullets. Take it slow. Big ravine here. Dutch killed a girl in a bad way. But it was a bad situation. That ain't like him, though. Tracks go left, down here. Davey got shot. Mac and John, both shot too. Sean, we don't even know. I'm surprised we escaped at all. By the time you boys showed up from the other side of town, we were only just holding on. Bad business, all right. Snow's coming in hot again. We'll lose these tracks if we don't move fast. yourself not very wide here come on boy horses are getting tired yeah a lot of fresh snow here uh, I don't know about this Javier I mean, we can't follow nothing uh, let's push on a little bit maybe we'll pick up the trail again let's hope so If he can hear us, come on up there. We're coming, John. He's coming from up ahead somewhere. I don't think we can go much further on the horses. We'll have to walk from here. I'd grab that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead?
you sure about this? It's coming from this way. Okay. Careful here. In the end of that, we're high up here. You're telling me. Drops down here. Watch yourself. Watch out here. Stay low under here. Okay. Good now. Watch your step. This is real slippery. Stay close. to the wall, up this way. Here. I definitely cool. thought he was a lot closer than this. We're coming, John! Keep moving then. Come on. John, can you hear me? Most. John. John. I'm here. Out on the ledge. That's John. We're coming. That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but it's good to see you, Arthur Morgan. You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Well, folks, that's about the first 30 minutes of Red Dead Redemption 2 on the Xbox One. If you like this video, check out our others, comment, like, subscribe. You know what to do. Thanks for watching. I think so. Come on. Hopefully this will lead us out.